right, in this video, we're gonna do three muscles at one time. This is pectoralis minor. This is major that should already be done. You can see it right there. So we're gonna do pectoralis minor, ziphy humeralis, and then there's a back muscle that we'll have to do by default right here called latissimus dorsi. Now, the first issue everybody's gonna to have to overcome is there's a piece of the cutaneous plexus, which is a skin muscle that's still attached. And on this cat, I can obviously, it's right here. You can see this thin, it'll be one, maybe a half a millimeter, a millimeter thick. All of this tissue needs to come off. So I'm gonna do that first on video. If there's a little bit left up underneath the tricep, don't worry about that for now, we'll clean that later. So I'm just gonna take this right back down to the muscle. And it's gonna make you nervous, but that's the muscle we want right there. So when I pull this up, you can see the cotton candy, it gets real white. That's not really cotton candy, by the way. So I'm just scraping with my scissors and I'm gonna remove this layer of muscle. That's the tissue we want underneath. Now this is gonna come right into pectoralis minor and it's gonna be pretty tight. So I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna keep working it until it just flakes off by itself. We don't wanna get this all chewy though. No chewy, chewy baka. Okay, so I, I pulled that off and now you can definitely see the edge of latissimus dorsi. Now I'm gonna continue back here. You cannot do this dissection until this is removed. It has to be removed. Because if you don't, you'll never see Ziphy humoralis. All right, and it's all interconnected in here. So we're gonna be really careful. I wanna be careful with my scissor work. See those fibers right there? That's Ziphy, we wanna save those. So I'm just gonna put a little pressure and you can see those are attached right there. They should just flake right off the edge. Let's hope. Okay. And again, this is the toughest part, trying to find your way through here without tearing up Ziffy humoralis. Where am I at? Looking underneath here. All right, now if you look underneath here, now I can see the edge of pectoralis minor right See the fibers are running the other direction. Ooh, can you see that? You can't see where I'm poking, but right there's daylight. If you look underneath here, there's the edge of the muscle. I can see it. Ooh. And this would be a lot easier if you had more experience. A ton easier. So you gotta be careful. I'm trying to get this off of Ziffy. Here's Ziffy humoralis right here. These fibers are the wrong color. Those are the wrong ones. There we go. That's the color I'm looking for right there. Uh, let me get with this technique. <laughs> Yowza, that almost tore. Don't do that. Don't do that. All right, so I'm just working. This is gonna be nice. Just removing connective tissue. I'm gonna keep going, same level. There's Ziffy humoralis right there. I'm just gonna work underneath here. These should just start flaking right off. And we're gonna clear this all the way to the midline. Some of your cats, this may already be done. Like that's all skin muscle right there. We don't need any of that. Oh, it's looking good now. If you try to start without clearing this skin muscle, you'll never be able to do this. Never. All right, I'm only going to clear to there because that's all I need for this dissection. That'll save me some time. Now, with that clear, you can see I'm just smoothing out with my fingers. There's one line. There's the next muscle right there. And then there's the third one, latissimus dorsi, coming in. All right, don't worry about this little bit of fat right here. We'll get rid of that in a second. All right, now the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna dissect this back muscle first because it's the easy one. Look, you can see that line. Make sure I'm on camera. There's where they all come together, right here. So I'm gonna dissect, there's a little bit of fat. I'm gonna dissect, from, let me put a hole in this cat. I'm gonna dissect from there all the way to the tendon back there. I'm gonna dissect that margin, get underneath it. And this is real easy where I'm gonna use scissors for this. I'm just gonna take off this layer of fat right here. 
I'm gonna find my way down to the muscle. Mm -hmm. Where's the edge of it? Okay, now I'm gonna I'm gonna rotate this cat. Come here, buddy. Good. Same technique. We've done this a million times. Bottom nose goes right on the line and lift it up. We're gonna create a small pocket. We literally have done this 10,000 times. Small pocket. Look at that. Take my scissors, nose wiggle. All right, there's the hole I made to indicate, there's where the two muscles come together. I don't wanna go any further than that right now. So I'm just gonna take my scissors, go right to that line. Now watch, support and scrape right on the edge of that fat. That muscle will pop right open. Look, I'm just going right underneath it. There's my other hole. Let's turn the camera. I have to turn it that way. There we go. There's the other hole. I'm going to come right back to that hole. Right there. Trim off this fat. Mm, we'll save that for later. Delicious. Okay. Now I have the edge started. I'm just going to use my scissors. I'm going to use the round side this time. You can see I'm clearing underneath there. Don't go any further. This is a tendon. We're just going to go right to where the muscle ends. I'll spin this cat a little bit more. Hey, buddy. Now you guys can't see what I'm doing underneath here, but I'm just going to clear all this connective tissue. Just getting this open. Don't go any further than right here, though. Okay, look, you should be able to get your hand in there now. Clean that all out. Check it out. There's latissimus dorsi all dissected. All right, that was the easy part. Come here, buddy. All right. This is where it gets a little tricky. All right, the next dissection. You can see the bottom of minor right here. We've done this a million times. Pick this up, and I'm just gonna use my scissors. Here's where they all come together, so we're gonna be careful. I'm not gonna do anything in here yet. Take my scissors, and I'm gonna scrape back to the sternum. Look at this. Look how easy that was. That's pectoralis minor. It's now started. Latissimus dorsi has started. But here's the big one right here. Here's the issue. This is Ziphi humoralis. It dives under right there. It dives under these two. So now you have to separate them. Best technique here, the push down. Oh, I'm going to use my scissors. Let me scrape this a little bit. Stay on the high side and watch. Push down. Scrape. Push down. Scrape, 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 whoop, nerve, cut. Push down, push down, clear, push down. Keep separating, pushing this one back down where it goes. Just using the nose, push down, push down. If you encounter any nerves or anything, just give them a little baby nip. Okay, now watch, I'm taking my thumb and my forefinger and I'm just rocking, I'm just rocking rocking. Now I have my, it's all the way up there. Now here's what we do. You can see the edge of latissimus dorsi. Don't try to separate these with a tool. I want you to just follow the edge and stay close here. Watch, it'll come right apart. Watch this. Don't cut like that. Stay close to the back side here. Oh, that's so nice. Now look, latissimus dorsi is free. Thumb, gentle push. I don't want to rip this one. We'll clean all that out of there in a second. All right, now I'm going to finish minor. I'm going to go right under it. Can I see that on camera? Yes, you can. Here's the edge of Ziphi humoralis right there. I need to get these two apart. Pull down, pull down, pull. Pull, oh. If the fibers get chewy, just put them back together. And then pectoralis minor is thick. It's a monster. Take my scissors. And you guys can always come look at this later. I'm all the way to the sternum. I'm all the way underneath it. Push down, push down. No scissor work in here. I don't want the brachial plexus cut. You can see I got that all cleared out. Now the last thing I have to do 
All I have to do is dissect Ziphi humoralis. You can see its margins right there and right there. So back to our regular technique, grab the edge of the muscle, lift it up, make a little scissor cut. And I'm just gonna follow the edge. I can see the edge. I'm just gonna slide my scissors like Christmas paper right down the line. Lift it up, scrape, scrape, scrape. Watch me come through the other side. Well, there's the other side. Piece of cake, actually piece of kitty. Come on, that was fun. That was funny. All right, so I'm just gonna follow the bottom edge. There's a little bit of connective tissue here. I'm just gonna just gently clean this off. Now this is where most of you will stop and you won't finish it. I want this thing completely free of fat and debris on both sides and underneath. Okay, got that free. I'm gonna take my scissors, sharp side, follow the line. Lift, follow the line. Lift, follow the line. Now I got that side done, I look under here and I scrape. And I scrape and I, whoa, look at that. Look how easy that was. Now this is where you'll detach it by accident. Be careful as you come into the final stretch run here. I'm still on camera. Make sure I'm rotated enough where you can see this. Okay, finish it. I'm going to stay real close to the muscle. Don't worry about that big glob of fat. We're going to clean that later. Just pulling this connective tissue down off the back side here. That's all connective tissue. Clean. Be careful. Slow down. Don't get aggressive here. And just leave that last little bit attached right there so it doesn't pull off. All right, my trim this so it looks pretty. Oh, look at that. Very nice. So we got to clean this latissimus dorsi, Ziphi humoralis, pectoralis minor, three for one, all dissected. Please do not worry about this fat yet. We'll do that in a separate video when we clean all this out. Okay, three for one. Ready, set, go.